Hi, welcome back once again to CBSC Board Economics. I'm Saddam Hussain. I welcome you all. We're carrying on with the monetary policy. Monetary policy is the central bank's money supply and credit control policy. Monetary policy is the central bank's money supply and credit control policy. We are seen under monetary policy, you have two broad instruments. One is quantitative instruments, the other one is qualitative instruments. Under quantitative instruments, we have already discussed, you have three sub-instruments, which are these, bank rate, number two, varying reserve ratios, that is CRR and SLR, and uh, one more that is uh, one is a bank rate and the bank rate you have repo rate reverse repo rate interest rate and then we discussed about varying reserve ratio varying reserve ratio you have crr and slr and the last one you have is open market operations we have seen all these three instruments then you have qualitative instruments. Qualitative instruments deal with the direction of the loan, whether it should be given for productive purposes or speculative purposes. Under this again you have three instruments. The first one which we discussed is margin requirements. The second one you have is moral situation. It's a small one. What exactly is moral situation? Whenever the Commercial banks, I mean, uh, uh, they, they get all the money from the central bank. The central bank has all the powers to instruct the commercial banks whether to give it loan or not. That is, uh, it's a kind of moral responsibility of the commercial banks the central bank is putting. What exactly is moral situation? It's a kind of persuasion and threat. It's a kind of persuasion, request by the central bank to the commercial banks. If there is excess demand in the economy or inflation in the economy or the prices are shooting up, galloping inflation we call it, and the prices are going up, the central bank requests the commercial banks not to lend money for speculation, control credit. It's a kind of request. They will be sending letters to them. They'll be requesting them orally. Or if these commercial banks don't fall in line with the request or the instructions of the central bank, the central bank has the power to threaten them, to amalgamate the banks, to close the banks, to liquidate the banks in the interest of the economy. So that is moral situation. Moral situation, we can read it here. Moral situation, it means advising, requesting and persuading the commercial banks to cooperate with the central banks in implementing its general monetary policy. Advising, requesting and persuading the commercial banks to cooperate with the central bank in implementing its general monetary policy. The central bank may request the commercial banks not to grant loans for speculative purposes. I repeat once again, under monetary policy, under qualitative instruments, though one of the important qualitative instruments is moral situation. Moral situation means it's a kind of request, it's a kind of uh, persuasion to the commercial banks by the central bank in case they don't follow in line of this guidelines of the central bank the central bank may threaten them the central bank may request the commercial banks not to give loans in case of excess demand and inflation in the economy or in case of deficient demand or deflation or depression in the economy the central bank may request the commercial banks to create more credit that is moral situation moral situation means it's a kind of request it's a kind of so oh, threat by the central bank to the commercial banks. That's all we have in this small video. Till we meet next time, it's goodbye.